Thank you. State lawmakers are reviewing what's called the Victim Privacy and Protection Act. The goal is to prevent certain evidence of sex crimes from becoming public record when the case is closed. NBC4's Elise Chengary has more on what the next steps are going forward. State Representative Rutherford says this bill is important because it would protect victims and their privacy so they won't have to be victimized all over again once a case is closed. I was contacted back in August by a local police department about uh, after they did public records training saying, hey, look, this is an issue that could potentially arise where a victim of a sexually oriented crime has photos, videos, whatever of them in the nude, in their underwear, something that's extremely private to them after the court case is over could potentially be subject to a public records request. And obviously, you know, we don't want to do that. That's re-victimizing a victim. That's where Rutherford felt as a husband and father, it was time to draft a bill saying certain types of material would be placed on a list of exemptions to not be released after a court case. Any legislation that we can put forward that is going to protect their rights and require their consent for public records to be shown would benefit all survivors and all victims of crime. Susan Wismar is the prevention education coordinator for a victims advocacy group. She says participating in the legal process is difficult for victims of crime. A highly traumatic event happened and now this has to be analyzed and picked apart in a public space in the courtroom and we need to make that process as victim centered and driven by the victim as possible so that they will participate in our justice system. We have to find a right balance to protect these victims from being victimized again. According to State Representative Rutherford, he says he's received support from the House for the bill and he hopes the bill will gain momentum in 2018. Reporting from the State House, Elise Chingari, NBC4.